So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. Now, once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down and then click on advanced options. And then where it says receive updates for Microsoft products, you're gonna turn this on. Now, you're gonna select Windows Update again and then click on check for updates. Make sure your computer is fully up to date. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in Xbox. You're gonna right click on it and then click on app settings. And then once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down and then click on terminate and then click on reset. And then click on reset again. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search again and type in device manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna expand display adapters. Then you're gonna find your graphics card. You wanna right click on it and then click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers. Make sure that you have the best drivers for device installed. I'm now gonna leave down below three links for Nvidia, AMD and Intel. You want to download the software that comes with your graphics card. For me I have an Nvidia graphics card so I got GeForce experience. And now you wanna head over to your software, you wanna click on the driver tab and then click on check for updates. Make sure your graphics card drivers are fully up to date from the software itself. And then once you complete all these steps, you just wanna restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.